video. Obviously, it leads into the next conversation with this one is that since we've been locked down and I've been home more, I've obviously been playing my VR. And a couple of months ago, I broke my finger because I was silly uh, by whacking it off the wall. Um, and then a couple of days ago, I broke my big toe. Uh, falling down the stairs. So, yes, we are allowed to laugh at him. Ha-ha. So clearly the <clears throat> lockdown physically has been bad for me because I'm a clumsy bastard who hurts himself. Um, Wait, but that... and how did you break a toe again? It wasn't the VR that did that. No, but I fell down the stairs. Oh, yeah. It's your it's dog's some... toy. Yeah, that somebody left a, a toy on the stairs, yes. No, it was him. It was, was him. It him. Oh, okay. Him. Yes. Um, but yeah, that, that leads on very well to the, the gaming side of things. Um, obviously we have, uh, our separate channels, which is not, for me, it's top box gaming, um, where we will game together, where I'll game yeah. and stream. Um, and, uh, Ray has, well, I have the, uh, the talk box aquarium. So if you check that out, um, we'll put a link in the description below so you guys can figure that out. Um, basically it's all about aquariums, you know, saltwater aquariums, freshwater aquariums, like how to set up an aquarium. I think the next video I'm going to do is going to be on. Um, like, like, how do we start an aquarium from the be- from the beginning? Like, here's an here's here's the tank, here's the heater, here's the filter. How do you put it all together to make yourself a tank? So yeah. I think that's gonna be the next video I do. Oh, that's good. But yeah, I look forward to actually seeing that. So obviously, for me, my um, I released a trailer uh, for my FIFA 21 series. I'm gonna do. Uh, as we all know, Man United's kind of going down the pooper. Um, so I've decided that. To, to cure my sanity of how bad they are they're doing that i would do a career mode where i would actually save them um i would make decisions i'd get rid of players i'd bring players in uh obviously i have tested career mode and the the stuff that they've added to it is really good so i actually really want to get that mm. a proper go this year so that's the reason why i'm doing a series on how i'm going to fix manchester united is um, that with the uh, people 21 yeah, yeah okay. and that's basically uh, my idea going forward. Obviously, with uh, FIFA 21, it's released uh, Is it five days up? ago. Oh, okay. It's, oh, it's five up. days ago. Um, on the uh, first day of release, the servers went down, which seems to be the norm for EA. Yeah. That's just normal. Like, they automatically seem to... EA, you mean early access? No, or EA mean... as an electronic okay. arts. It's not early access. I mean, FIFA should be early access because it feels broken every year. But, <laughs> um, so yeah, and obviously when the servers came back up, they had to disable division rivals and ultimate team, mm-hmm. which is one of the main game modes on that actual service. Mm. So it was it was a few like rough days uh, for FIFA. I mean, my, my first impressions of it is that it's, it's the same game reskinned, but it feels better. There's a couple of rough edges that 20 had that was just so off-putting. That 21 seemingly still has rough edges, but doesn't have as many. Uh, I'm very excited for what they've done with career mode, as I've said previous. Um, and uh, everything else just seems to be better than the last game. Uh, Does it still so, have that thing where you couldn't alt-tab? It well, doesn't football. seem to. Basically, what Ray's referencing was that when I got FIFA 20 on my PC, any time I was in an online game, if I accidentally clicked onto my second monitor or Alt-Tab to, to minimize the application, it would kick me out of online games. Um, I haven't tested it fully, yeah. but I have clicked off when I've been on Ultimate Team and it didn't kick me from Ultimate okay. Team. It's a weird, it's a weird mechanic. Like, you know, if you get a message or something or email, you want to check that real quick while you're playing yeah. a game. It's the same mechanic on the Xbox. The Xbox yeah. did the same thing. You press the Xbox button while you're in a game, it would kick you from the game. Yeah. For whatever reason. I don't yeah. know why they had that feature. Um, but yeah, that's one of the upcoming uh, series that I've got. Um, uh, the other upcoming things on our um, upcoming videos on uh, Talkbox Gaming is I obviously have three episodes of Phasmophobia. Uh, already up there um, I'm hoping to get a few more of them recorded of the different haunted areas I think there's six in total so there should be another three episodes uh, Star Wars Squadrons um, I now I have my uh, new Oculus Quest uh, 2 um, so I'm hoping to actually record the full story I haven't decided whether or not I'll do that live or whether or not I'll just record it and then put it up on YouTube but I'll obviously you'll know if you 
follow uh, Talkbox Gaming. Um, and uh, there's also another out of nowhere game, uh, the Game of Thrones board game, uh, a game I've been playing with my friends for years since it came out. It's uh, very much an in-person board game. They've made a proper PC version of it, and uh, there's a couple of issues. There's a couple of problems with it, but me and my mates have been playing that, so I might actually uh, stream that at some point as well. Thanks for watching. If you liked our video, give us a like and smash that subscribe button. For more videos, click to the left. Bye.